Well, welcome back to another episode, and I've fixed this situation. I put a double gate in. I moved the wall down a little bit, I put a double gate in. Or I should say, what? I, I removed some wall and put a double gate in. Because you can't actually just move a wall down in real life, can you? <laughs> So that's what we've done there. We've moved forward into January the 3rd. Um, so what we need to do, I think, is um, make some adjustments. We've had a suggestion that we should buy another tractor. And you know, it's right, it's probably the right decision. That looks like we've got more cows in there now. Oh, definitely. It's definitely more than 15 cows in there now, isn't there? Good for you. They're eating us out of house and home. We're going to have uh, issues with the low amount of silage that we have, for sure. Um... So yeah, there's not a lot I can do about the situation now, you know? Frosty grass again. I can't cut this. Not yet. At least I don't think I can. Grass is usually harvest any time. Oh, okay. It is still harvest any time. All right. Huh. Maybe we can. Oh, I bet it won't let us cut it, though. Hmm. Maybe that's what we should do. Cut the grass. Yeah. All right. Let's put the bucket over here. Oh, oh. Keep forgetting that that is there. And we will release ourselves. It's quite a distance away, isn't it? Shall I get it delivered? Where is the old... Uh, it's right up here. Let's have a jolly up there. We'll have a jolly up there so you can see it. And then we'll lease ourselves a mower that I've got. Planned. The old Big Max. She will get us up there in no time at all, I'm quite sure. I was expecting cars, but there was nothing. We're all right. So, I don't know. Whoa, the deer, the deer. They just jumped out. It wasn't my fault, officer. Whoever's behind me can have it. <laughs> what a strange law that is. It is a strange law, anyway. There's the uh, farm there. Which backs onto our cows. Lovely, lovely buildings that Mr. Oxygen has uh, built. And scenery. He's done a truly fantastic job. Although he's got his hedges here a little bit regimental. The one on the right's okay, but the one on the left's very regimental, look at that. Shame, shame. <laughs> I like picking holes. I can't help it. It doesn't matter who makes it. I'll pick a hole. If there's one to pick, I'll pick it. I looked at that as a possible area for building a farm on when I was looking at it all. 
but I chose to go the route we've gone. There's the windmill. What a beautiful sight. We've got one near us. Where I live. Down Road. I suppose I haven't gone past it, have I? No. Don't think so. Let me stop here. Yeah, I think it's just here. Where that truck is. No, that truck is in somebody's driveway. How about that? This is ye oldy poob. I must have gone past it. Let's get the old mappage. Oh no, the turning is just coming up. Oh no, it's not. It's much further on. How rare. It's much further than I thought it was. There's a an allotment. I wonder if there's allotment to be going on there. Oh, <laughs> I'm on fire today. Oh. <laughs> here's, here's the old dealership then. <laughs> um, now I have because it, uh, we don't get one. I've. Uh, oh yeah. Who put that gate there? It's rude, isn't it? We could have gone straight through that. Through that, yeah. Let's do that. Whoa! You're looking busy. So we've got we've got a loader up here. We've got a, a forklift that I've persuaded this dealership to purchase so that we can use it should we need to. Um, so let me in. All right, dude. What the? Let's <laughs> um. Let's do it. Let's do it this way. No zebra. This way. Ooh, here we go. The Furigo or Furigo. I think the big one. Is going to work, yeah, 110 horsepower. Now, do we want rollers? Or do we want wheels? Rollers, wheels. Wheels look cool, rollers serve a purpose. Whether it does with this or not, I don't know. Position of the design. What the? Just go with it like that. Top link position. Is that going to make a difference to us? Let's have it on high. Power takeoff. No, we don't want to change the color. Position of deflectors. Something like that. Oh no, it was at 70, wasn't it? Let's just have it like that, so we can see it all going on. We don't want mulcher, we want mower. But we can change that. And do you know what? I think I'm going to actually buy this. No, I'm not. I'm going to lease it. Because if it's rubbish, we're not committed then. If it's good, then we can buy it afterwards. So, there we go. Hey, he's turned into a lady. I'm not going to say what was going through my head then. <laughs> seems to, I am going to say it. That seems to be very common in today's world. Dude just turns it. Dude, dude, dude looks like a lady. Did Aerosmith know all about it then? Yes. Of course they did. Because it was, it, was it was all happening then anyway, wasn't it? That's frigging cool. I like the sound effects for that. Probably a little bit OTT, but hey ho. We, we should have really put the weight on. That, that mower looks grand, doesn't it? Six meters of choppy choppy. Oh, yeah. Let's get it back to the yard then. I won't bore you again. 
Well, there's our cows over there, looking rather splendid. They're going to need feeding, but I won't bore you with that today. I'll, I'll do that later on. Uh, I think we're going to do the little paddock first. See how this works. Oh no, we need the weight, don't we? That's alright, we need the weight, Seabur. Oof. Don't we just? Oh, we're turning right here. <laughs> Might need to do a bit more driving around here to get a little bit more comfortable with it. This weight is way too big for the front of this thing. Right. Let's do this field first then. I wonder what it sounds like when it's going. If it's they've worked hard on the the sound effects for it folding down. <laughs> Very good. Oh, that's the front weight sheeper. There we go. Oh yeah, that looks great, doesn't it? Doesn't that look great, guys? We'll do them individually, shall we? Is that a bush or is that a tree? Will it chop down? It does. See you later. I not want you in my field. Actually, this is quite a substantial field, isn't it? I'll get rid of you too. This is it. Oh, well, we've got lots of grass, haven't we? We've got lots of grass field. So I've got that, that puppy there as well. I? Did I buy that one? I can't remember now. Yes, sir. I very much like this. And as, as you should already know, it is one of my favourite pastimes, mowing. Oh, we got a gate there. That's handy to know. So that will go on to that main road that we were just on. I won't bother going in there. That would be a pain to get the grass out. It's huge field. Huge field. Splendid. Well, we will. I will crack on with this. Um, there'll be time lapse and jump cut. I am sure of it, but it will be what it will be. Tis what it is, and all that, you know.
Well, you know when they say, try before you buy? I've tried this mower before I bought it. And I come to the conclusion that I should have just bought it. Because it is brilliant. This mower is brilliant. If you've not used it yet, get it downloaded. Get it on your tractor. And get to mowing with it. Because it is... It is brilliant. Effortless. You don't need a big tractor for it. It does a widespread... It's very... It, yeah. I cannot fault this. At all. I just can't. Lift it up then. There we go. Alright, so... Will it go in our shed up here? It will. Does it need to be... lowered? Yes, it needs to be unfolded. That... is not grand. I wonder if it'll go in the other one then. I'll stick it in the middle. Is it low enough, or is it gonna... Nope! <laughs> Wheelies! Okay, so let's unfold him then. We're gonna keep it. I'm gonna buy it. There it is. The f Fangio? Fagio? Farigo! <laughs> Fangio! Get your Ferraris on, boys. I suppose we have got the Ferrari of tractors. Okay, so, um... I need to lease a windrower. I'm gonna ted that field. That one that we just did. And, um... Turn that one into hay. And I may split and have some hay out of that one as well. Yeah, I may do that, because, um... Because we're going to need hay. We've only got four bales of hay. There we go. I was getting a bit perplexed then as to why it wasn't playing ball. So... Yes, I'm going to take this. I'll give you, um... What should we do? Well, let's see how quickly it gets done. I don't want to fill the video with time lapses. <coughs> We, we, it is only a small bob. That's the that's the only drawback to it. Maybe the next thing that we need to upgrade is to slightly bigger one, one with possibly six. Rather than four, I guess. Well, six meters is probably our go to size, really, for everything. The mower's six meters. This would be good if it was six meters. Uh, Windrower is a different story, uh, as, as wide as you can get, that's actually going to work without difficulty in these fields, for sure. I think I did download a really nice crone windrower, though. 
So we'll probably grab all of that, get that going. But yeah, we'll, um, we'll just rattle through this. It's not taking too long, is it? It's not taking too long at all. So I think I'm going to try a few tractors before I buy them. I know I've tried a lot. I tried a lot in Attingham. I was very fond of the Deutz. Um, so she could be a strong possibility. It needs to be something with around about 250 horsepower, is my reckoning. I think that's probably our target, although a lot of the machinery is some the plow that I want, the Ermo plow, I think requires 280 horsepower for the five furrow. Although we don't necessarily need a five furrow, we could get away with the four. So it's um Yeah. Some things I need to sit and work out. I'm gonna try this fent this re revised version of the fent that I had on Attingham and see what she's like. So she is actually gonna be the first one that we we try. I think it's a uh, 800 Vario, I think. I think. Don't hold me to that. <clears throat> but it will be, um, it will be in the next episode. We'll need that for the baler because the baler requires more. Oh, actually, does it? I don't know. We'll find out in the next episode when we crack on with that. But, uh, Yeah, JCB is a good choice too, see, because we're going to have a lot of road work going on, twos and throwing. So fast track could possibly be the way to go. It will have the horsepower, but it will also have the speed. Speed! Although the Deutz is pretty quick. Hmm. We all know that the Deutz is the Lamborghini of tractors. So the case is the Ferrari of tractors. Deutz is the Lamborghini of tractors. And if you if you don't believe me, right? Just think about who owns Case now. That's right. It's Fiat. Who does Fiat own? Ferrari. It's the Ferrari attractors. And when it comes to Deutz being Lamborghini, well, we all know the situation there. Because it is. Period. Now, when it comes to Massey's being the Mercedes of tractors, well, that's just because we like Massey's and they're beautiful. didn't want to do that anyway that is where I'm gonna leave it for today's episode with you anyway I'm gonna I'm gonna crack on with this and get this get this um, Ted Ted <laughs> it's a ridiculous word isn't it I'm gonna get this turned not all of it clearly because we need silage too but thanks for watching everyone stay safe and may the weather be with you